Hey everybody, Terry Schaffer from Hollywood Weapons. I hope you're all doing well under this quarantine period. I know I've tried to stay busy and in keeping with Hollywood Weapons tradition, I've been developing different weapons at different ranges, but more importantly, I've learned a few things about my partner, Larry Zanoff. He's really into billiards and he is excellent at painting small scale miniatures. So yeah, what's he doing now? Zanoff, what's going on? Let me guess. You want to figure out how to stop a Sharknado now. <laughs> That's funny, and you're wrong, because two things. One, Sharknado season isn't for three months, and B, you can't really stop it. So, what's happening? What are you doing? Well, I'm working on my my stamp collection, which is really kind of interesting, because, oh you know... Oh, my God, you're right. For... That is incredibly interesting. So interesting. Hey, listen, man. I'm feeling pretty good, Larry. You know, I've been working, we, we've been working on different weapon systems at different ranges. I'm feeling pretty good about this. Yeah, you know what? That's typically both arrogant and a little bit complacent on your part, I must yeah, say. Yeah, wait, 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 what? What do you mean complacent, me? Yeah, you. You know, you got to build in redundancies into your armory. I mean, you've got your long-range soda mortar, right? You've got your potato chip can shotgun effect, and you've got your flamethrower. But what about the mid-range, man? Huh. I think I know where you're going with this. <laughs> That'll be a first. Later. Rude. This is Hollywood Weapons. Okay, so Buzz Killington, in his usual way, made a good point, and he let me know that I have to work on developing a middle-range weapon. So, okay, give it to me, buddy. Yeah, and the Tiger King, I just can't get over it. You know, it's like, I mean, I'm just... Dude, can I, did, did, over here, pay attention. And now it's time for the most popular part of the show. Me, when I said, it's time for Terry's Knuckle Science in quarantine. Uh, it was like one fan letter, so you tone it down a bit. Take this out. He's good. I got to give it to him. He's good. Okay. So I was thinking, do you guys ever watch Mission Impossible, that show from like the 70s? It was so great. It always started out with the striking of a match and all these great things followed. A match. There's a lot of power in the head of a match when, when these things ignite and the gases come out and power things. So I'm going to try to make a rocket with a match head and a piece of tin foil. And I have to give credit to Dave Hacks on YouTube. He's got a great site that has a lot of interesting things to try. I'm going to give this a go. Should be interesting. Well, Zanoff, I'm back. <laughs> what now? Not in love with your tone. OK, listen, man. I've put a little time into this. I've developed my medium range rocket launcher system patent pending. So, and notice I have safety goggles. I'm Very so important. proud of you. I can't tell you how proud I am. All right, so here we go with this one. Something's going to happen, right, oh, Terry? It went. It went. Look, look. I got another one, though. So these are the ones that are, like, maybe for, like, a little bit closer range. Oh, closer range, yeah. Yeah. These ones you can carry in your rucksack. And, of course, the wind decides to pick up right now. Yeah, there you go. My work here is done. Enemy thwarted. You're welcome for your freedom. Yeah, miraculously enough, you've actually stumbled onto the rudimentary art of rocketry, which is really interesting because the Chinese invented rockets originally, and they were even used to great effect during the Napoleonic That's War. That's awesome. Listen, I'm really, really thirsty. I got to go. I've, I've been working really hard. Good to see you, man. Well, there you have it. Hey, uh moderately successful test. Uh, listen, seasons one to three of Hollywood Weapons is streaming on MOTV and look for this summer for season four where I will have a team of competent people to make this stuff really good.
I'll see you soon.